Where did you bring her? Nowhere. You're under arrest. Oh, come, come on. What are you doing? Stay no, here. let me go. Let me Stay go. Here. Ow. Ow. Mom. Mom. Are you okay? What happened, baby? I don't know. I'm under arrest. Ma'am, we're with the police department. We're investigating a sexual assault case. We believe your son may be involved. No, Mom, don't believe them. Don't believe them. Everything's gonna be okay. I'm gonna take care of it, okay? Shh, just calm down. There must be a misunderstanding, officer, because my son will never hurt a soul. But I'm glad you're here. Thank you. So you had a story you wanted to tell me? There was a girl. She was beautiful, innocent. But everything changed after one night. And that night, after a college party, she was raped. She was raped seven times. She was drugged. She never knew what the drug was. She, she was wide awake, but she couldn't move. She couldn't cry for help. She couldn't cry for help. The next day, she went to the police. She couldn't say anything. She, she didn't see anything. She was blindfolded. She didn't, didn't see anything. <laughs> so you wrote this in your diary, and then one day your son noticed it? You're the girl. Harris, he called the police every single day. But the police didn't do anything. I'm sorry, he just wanted to call your attention. He just wants to know. He wants to know who did it. He wants to know who his father is. <laughs> 20 years, and the police never investigated the cause. 20 years. Until today that I see you and that young man here in my house. I'm so sorry. Don't say that, Detective. That's not going to change anything for us. Detective, I'm thirsty. I want to drink something. As time passes, people just forget that poor, innocent young girl. Come on, let's go. You serious? I'm just gonna let them get away with this. We have a more important investigation to focus on right now. We're gonna find this rapist and bring him to justice. Thank you, officer. I promise.